linesmen Kevin Hastings, Scott Reed, referees Ryan Harrison, Brent Colomb, head coach John Dean. We'll start Yarmer Pitlick centering how to shell and Roth. Sambrook and O'Rourke, the defense, grounds in their home red with white trim. Windsor, road white with blue, grounds right to left in your radio dial, and we're underway. Wins. Stevenson, a dump in forced by Windsor with 13.30 to go in the first period. And a scoreless game. Up the right side wall, puck comes off the Spitfire leg, banked up the right wing, Roth a little step, out of shell, driving the net, the trailer, Kalisti, shot, scores! Keegan Houdeschel might have got the last piece of it. Right off the post, and he does. A backhand will produce his 45th of the year and a 1-0 Greyhound lead. Yeah, nice job. 50. We talked about it all year. Will he hit the 50-goal plateau? Five away as this at this moment. Did you go over or under? I can't remember. Uh, yeah, we, don't we, both, we both picked the same answer. I trust think, me. I think we did. I, both, I think we both said over. Here's oh. the puck put in front. Scores. Turnover. In behind the net in the Greyhounds. Going to see Boca side of the net, fire at home in Windsor. We'll tie the hockey game. Yeah, Douglas got Face off will be to the side of the net, there to the left of Vince. As that's off the glass, through the legs of Laguerre, one on one. As Perbu steps around Hallowell, but he gets a stick on it, and then the shot goes in. Low blocker side, 2 1 Windsor, 40 seconds into the second period. 11.17 to go here in period number two. 2-1 Windsor leading. Face off outside of Windsor territory. Far side of the ice. And the grounds. Carry it in over the line. Near side. Hallowell opens himself up. Now steps back between the dots. Push it to his left. Trot side of the net for McKay. McKay back to the wall. Trot out to Houdisha. Scores! Second of the afternoon. 46th of the season. Power play goal ties this one up. That's knocked down to the corner. Good save as Pitlick out to the middle, but that's ahead of Roth. And Hano puts it in front of the ground bench. 8.30 to play here in the second of a 2-2 game. Far side wall over and across. There's a shot. Scores. Perbu second of the afternoon. A high drive. Fan the first time, tight angle, beats it over top, a down Taylor for a 3-2 lead. Tron, Tron, shot goes cross corner, Ryan O'Rourke, right point. Down and behind the net for Karche, Karche far side wall to the half boards, back to the point, O'Rourke, low drive, Insel swiped that aside, and onto the near side boards, back in, kept in. There by Karche, has help from McKay. Further ahead to Trot, Trot around the goal, can he wrap it around, scores! Colton Inns couldn't get to the left side as quick as Zach Trot got around the goal and give that ground his 11th of the season and tie this one at three. Over a step ahead of Roth. Can't keep it in the line, but it gets him behind. Weaves back over Hallowell, right wing side. Into the circle, high shot, Inns clubs it down. He'll poke the puck forward. Perbu's got pressure. Final minute, a hear of overtime. 55 seconds remaining in the extra session. Stales wide on the right side around Roth, flips it, scores. To the goal and over top the ground net and the Windsor Spitfires will win 4-3 in overtime.